Hi guys, so I'm in a massive hurry, so I thought, wouldn't it be ingenious if I put together a video which showed me doing a 10 minute makeup routine. It's very quick, I'm just going to the mall and I don't want to look like garbage. So, without further ado, I'll start. The first step I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, prime my face using L'Oreal Studio Secrets Matching Perfecting Base. Um, so what I'm going to do is, you don't need a whole lot of this stuff. So I'm going to take little dabs, it's a mousse-like consistency. Take little dabs and apply it to my face. So it doesn't take a whole uh, long time to dry. Okay. I'm going to try my best not to cut this video because I really want to see if I can do this in 10 minutes. Okay, now apply some to your forehead. And the other side. Oh, I'm getting something there. Okay, so I'm done priming my face. My next step is going to be to apply concealer. This is my Coastal Sense Camo Quad. Using this one right here. Just covering up any problem areas. Because I don't like this that much under my eyes, I'm going in with my mineral, my Maybelline Mineral Power Concealer. I have this in light one. And I'm basically concealing the entire triangular area below my eye. Because it looks weird if I have a yellow tone concealer in just one section of my face. Okay. Now I'm going to apply my foundation, Maybelline Mineral Power Foundation in Light 1 as well. I'm just going to apply this with my fingers because I am in a hurry. Oh, and this is actually Light 2, 3. It's not Light 1. This is more of a yellow tone. Just apply this to my chin. My cheeks. I don't want to be all fancy schmancy and just going to the mall, but I also don't want to look, you know, gross. In case I do see people I know there, which happens often. I run into people who go to my school and they're like, what? And they're probably thinking, wow, she looks hideous. Why doesn't she wear makeup? Okay. I wish this blended in faster so that I could hurry, because I am in a very big hurry. Right? Now I'll put just some more on the problem areas. What the hell is this thing on my nose? Okay. And I'm just going to clean my hands off a little bit with hand sanitizer because so I have foundation all over them. Alright, so this is what I have so far. I'm going to, as my setting powder, use my e.l.f. Complexion Perfection Palette. I don't use the colors individually. I use it as a setting powder. So I'm just going to swirl all the colors together. and buff this onto my face. Okay. I'm going to be doing a review on this shortly. I've been using this for about a week. Next step is I'm going to start doing my eyes. I'm going to be using my e.l.f. Mineral Eyeshadow Primer. Pat some on there. and blend it into my eye. Put some on. 
blends it all over. The mirror is like really far away from me, so I can't see how much I apply. Now because this is a quick makeup look, I'm only going to be using two eyeshadows. I'm just going to be using this Neutrogena Nourishing Eye Duo in, I think it's Iced Coffee, it's number 20. So I'm going to be taking an eyeshadow brush and this lighter shade, the Champagne, be putting on my eyeshadow brush and just patting it all over my lid. Like that. Same to the other eye. So a, this is a very pretty nude champagne frosty color. Okay. I'm just going to top off the excess somewhere. I'm just going to put it on my arm. And now. I'm actually going to take this contour brush and I'm going to also put it into the champagne and I'm just going to apply this as a highlight up top. I use this color as a highlight quite frequently. Okay, so I'm going to take this darker color and pop that right in my crease. The thing with this contour brush is that it gives it's not as precise for crease work as my Essence of Beauty brush, but I still find it does the job. This just gives a very soft look. It's not as dramatic. It's not as harsh. Okay. See how this looks, I have no idea. Okay, it actually looks quite good, surprisingly. I'm like sitting two and a half feet away from the mirror, so plus some more. All right, good. Now I'm going to take the highlight color again, put that back on here. Put out the harsh line and reapply the champagne color to my lid. Let's bring that out a little bit more. Okay. This is what I have on my eyes. It is very subtle. It is very faint. Um, you can choose to add less or more. It's really your. I'm going to skip on the liquid and now I'm going to curl my lashes and apply mascara. I need the mirror for this. Okay, now the same the other eye. Done with the mascara. Now I'm going to take my e.l.f. complexion brush and some bronzer. Swirl this. Just do a very light application. Up and down the nose. Across the forehead. My Physician's Formula bronzer it really isn't a bronzer. It's more like a shimmery. I don't even know what it does. And I'm taking my um, Rimmel Blush and Sandra Rose. I'm just going over the apples on my cheeks. <clears throat> Ooh, I to that one. Blend this in. And too much, puff it out. 
And now as a final step, I'm applying my Maybelline Color Sensational Lip Gloss in Touch of Toffee. And we are finished. So this is a look. I think I took 11 minutes, so sue me. But it's really quick. It actually uses quite a bit of products, but not so much on the eyes. And yeah, um, feel free to copy this look or do whatever you want with it. Bye.